April 7th, 2023. About to do a build, another build, 612s, fourth order, waiting on a box design. I'm really impatient, but good things are worth waiting for. There's an old one, about to do it here. I'll speed up the process. Just doing this for fun, really. Uh, six Defcons 12s, the 302s on three AAB 7900s. Um, headway, 128 amp hours. Uh, we building that in the back. Ford Expedition. Um, currently no wall, so I'm doing a fourth order C pillar. We'll see how that does. Uh, if I don't like that, next I'll go six order and probably do, I don't know, add two or three or I don't know how many. I'll add some. It'll get nasty. Um, so yeah, stay tuned. Well, the design finally came in. And so you know what we're doing. We're going to tear it apart and rebuild. So, I had to take my batteries out, all my paneling, my seats, of course. But, it should be pretty cool. Whenever we're done, let me go from the back and build a platform all the way to the front seats. You can see it a little bit better here. But, the platform's going to come all the way out. It's an expedition, so there's a big difference. So, but that's fine. Um, gonna mount the four channel amp on that side of the platform. I thought about keeping the back seats, but I know I'm gonna go bigger in the future. And so I might as well just build my platform now and it'll take up, I don't know, a lot of cabin space, so. I haven't done the math, but I mean, that's probably, I don't know, eight cubes, maybe. We'll see. I'll measure it sometime. But it should be pretty nice. We're doing the fourth order wall C-pillar. Um, hopefully I have enough space to do speaker, make some speaker pods for some six and a halfs on either side. Um... I don't know, we'll see. I'll keep videoing, but it's gonna look good. We got a lot of new stuff. Um, it should be pretty wild. I thought about sliding instead of going C-pillar since I do the platform, sliding it forward. Um, but the front of the expedition, like you can see like B-pillar and that's where I ride. So I would have to fiberglass a lot and uh, I just don't know if I have the time to do that now. So, C pillar, I can make it come right up here. And so I can build a nice wall panel because that is like straight up right there uh, against the plastic. And there's not that much of a contour. Um, so it'd be easy. But I'm keeping my headliner. I like the street look. I got an air system up there, which takes up a lot of space, which sucks. But we'll just see. I'll compress it. I don't know. I don't care about selling the car when I'm done with this. I bought this thing for like four grand. Looks good. I'll probably keep it till it blows up and junk it. So we'll see. Guys, just a little tip. Anytime you unplug an amp, Make sure you screw your set screws back in so they don't fall out. You will thank me later. Well, got all the amps out, batteries out, wires out. About to pull the subs. She's looking pretty bare. Making progress. Day two, by the way, day two. Well, just pulled the first sub, and looky there. What is that? Uh, it 
that's my LED light I lost. And they still got a little bit of juice. Barely. I've been looking for that. Anything else in here? Nope. Sweet. Good find.